allow me fixing everything and because there is always something to be fixed today I'm sure how to replace the seals and gaskets on the pro group on a Delonghi Magnifica first thing we're gonna do is remove the drip trim while we're here you can uh, wash the drip tray now we need to take the brew group out of the machine just squeeze here and pull out and the brew group comes out now for the quality of the seal you can judge by pressing onto this one and we can see that it's so hard <laughs> this is proper hard I didn't had one like this one for a long time now can you see this clip this plastic bit here yeah just get it unclipped from the plastic and this ridge is on the bottom okay so what we're gonna do now is we'll just take this thing out nothing to do here yeah nothing to do don't even think of anything else and now push you can see my fingers it's proper stuck in here okay push a bit more there we go so these two needs to be replaced i've seen in a a lot worse shape as well what i'm gonna do now is i'll just wash it off while we're here i'll just wash this one on the back as well okay so while the top part is cleaning let's just take this one and move this one away also this one away and now under the sink i'll just clean up any debris of coffee on the outside okay this one is cleaned you can see how much better it looks now what we need is seals for the Longi Magnifica. I don't have a part number, but when you look for them, it's the only thing that you're gonna get. What you can do now, take some food grade silicone grease on your finger and just like this, okay? Now get it in the second ridge, press with your thumb and just stretch it around. Good, perfect. Other one, a little bit of this one. Take it from here. Good. Let me put this one back together. Now I think it's a good practice to clean all this away. Don't disassemble nothing. You're not going to find anything that needs additional work in this mechanism. Okay, so what we need to do this is the cylinder of the drug group. You take some silicone onto the finger right there and just smear it around on the cylinder wall, just like that. A bit more. This is a five gram, six grams tube. It's enough for lubricating at least three machines. Also, here in this area, lubricate. each side yeah this makes the transmission on the machine move a lot easier which makes the power supply work a lot easier so the whole thing onto the machine is a lot easier now what are we gonna do this and this go to the same side can you see how much easier it moves this is the yeah look at the difference good this is done now next thing will be there is one more seal 
Okay, there is one more seal that needs to be replaced. And this seal is right there. Can you see it? This one looks in a good condition, but I'll still show you how to <coughs> replace it. What do you do? Is just go into there. Just like that. And take it out. Clean in this area also as much as you can. Now the new seal, same as the ones from the brew group. Take a little bit of uh, full grade grease, as we did in the other one. And just with your fingers, I'm not gonna even watch. Do this, okay? Perfect. And now we can put it all together, give it a test drink at least five six coffees no make five six coffees before you drink the first one just to get rid of any excess silicon grease and uh, the greaser in the brew head i hope this video helps and i'll see you on to the next one bye bye